Hello, welcome to DocPlex's Middle East Health Minute. A reputed American magazine has listed 29 Saudi hospitals among over 2,200 best hospitals from 27 countries in its world's best hospital list for 2022. The list was created based on opinions taken from more than 80,000 experts around the world, including physicians, hospital administrators, health professionals, and the public. Surgeons in Fujairah have successfully removed a rare meningioma tumor and implanted a 3D printed prosthetic in the skull gap of a woman, thereby reconstructing the skull. The polyethylene ketone prosthetic was designed and 3D printed in collaboration with an American health authority. The Ministry of Health of the UAE has approved Pembrolizumab, developed by a renowned pharmaceutical giant to treat triple negative breast cancer. The UAE is the second country to approve the drug, followed by the USA. According to experts, the combination of new drug and chemotherapy reduces the recurrence of triple negative breast cancer. A study published in the journal Molecular Autism has shown that autistic adults have an increased risk of chronic physical and mental health conditions including arthritis, breathing concerns and neurological conditions compared to non-autistic adults. In addition, autistic individuals receive lower quality healthcare due to their social communication challenges when consulting healthcare professionals. A study conducted in Europe with middle-aged women approaching menopause showed that menopause causes increased body fat accumulation, especially around the waist. This has moderately negative effects on the hormones derived from the adipose tissue. The study findings show that relatively healthy behavior and habits of participants can help them sustain metabolic health despite these changes during menopause. What are the medical strategies to help cope with effects of menopause? Share your views by commenting below. Health Minute, the most popular segment of Docplexus is now available for the Middle East every Tuesday and Friday. Stay tuned for the latest happenings in the medical field and happy Docplexing!